motion planning around obstacles with convex optimization. Consider the problem of designing a smooth trajectory through a maze. This is a very challenging task for existing motion planners, such as trajectory optimization or sampling-based methods. Through the solution of a convex optimization problem, our motion planner can efficiently find a curve of minimum length that traverses the maze, or a minimum time trajectory that satisfies given velocity constraints. We name our motion planner GCS, which stands for Graphs of Convex Sets. GCS is fast, since it is based on efficient convex optimization. It handles a limited but important class of differential costs and constraints. And under some assumptions on the problem structure, it is also a complete motion planner. How does GCS work? Assume we want to plan a trajectory around the two red obstacles in the figure. The first step is to decompose the free space into convex sets. This decomposition can be approximate, and it can be computed using algorithms that work efficiently even in high dimensions and with complex robots. Secondly, we form the intersection graph of the convex decomposition of the free space. Each convex set is a vertex in the graph, and every pair of convex sets that intersect is connected by an edge. Third, we assign a trajectory segment to each convex set. Finally, we use the optimization framework that we have developed in the article Shortest Paths in Graphs of Convex Sets. This allows us to formulate an optimization problem where choosing a path through the graph activates suitable costs and constraints on the trajectory segments. This is natively a mixed integer optimization, but its convex relaxation is typically very tight. So tight that GCS works only in two steps. It solves the convex relaxation and it recovers a collision-free trajectory with a cheap rounding algorithm, without any branch and bound. This is almost always sufficient to identify a trajectory that is globally optimal within the parameterized class of curves. We use GCS to plan the flight of a drone through randomly generated buildings, and we study the quality of the trajectories generated with our rounding technique. On 95% of the problems, GCS designs a trajectory that is within 1% of the global optimum. And even in the worst case, the optimality gap is smaller than 3%. By comparing the cost of the relaxation and the rounded solution, GCS gives us a conservative estimate of the suboptimality of the trajectories that it designs. On 84% of the instances, GCS certifies that the return solution has an optimality gap smaller than 7%. Using a robot arm with 7 degrees of freedom, we compare GCS with widely used sampling-based planners. The trajectories designed by GCS have a lower cost in all the tasks in this benchmark. GCS is also as fast or even faster than the sampling-based competitors. Unlike sampling-based methods, our approach can efficiently scale to high-dimensional problems. Here we show multiple manipulation tasks with two robot arms with 7 degrees of freedom each. Through the solution of a convex program, GCS can plan the motion of both arms, preventing collisions with the environment and between the arms. In these tasks, both the timing and the order in which the objects are picked and placed are optimized. 